Adventures video. Today it's Exmoor. Well, we're heading for Dunkery Beacon today. It's the highest point on Exmoor. On a good day, you can see seven counties from up there. So we'll see when we get there what we can see. Uphill. Well, we're nearly at the top. The beacon's just up there. A group of hikers that we saw earlier on it. We're nearly there. It's quite busy up here at the moment. Well, here we are. We're at the top of Dunkery Beacon. Dunkery Hill. This is the beacon on top of Dunkery Hill. So there you go. Dunkery Beacon behind me. Different things 
turns around how far away they are. Heading for in the distance to a bit of lunch. Quarter to twelve right now. Starting with uh, fridge raiders. And while we stop for lunch, that's the view we got. There is no rain in the forecast for today. But there is rain around up here. Not a lot, but just a bit. So we're a little bit sheltered here, behind this hedge. We'll be getting lunch set up in a minute. Lunch is on. Some sausages in there being cooked on the mountain warehouse stove. And I'm also going to cook a couple of sausages using this in here. There's a new piece of kit, which is a pocket stove. So I'm going to try that one as well while we're here. So I'll just get that all out and we'll see what we get. So there it is, there's the burner, windshield, Not the stove, so there should be another bit inside the bag. I'll put all that together, get it lit, see how it goes. So that's what you get, the little windshield, burner and the stand. I'm not going to use the stick table to do it because it'll probably melt. So we'll put it down on the ground over here somewhere. And we're getting lit. And what we're going to do is we're going to fill it with the methylated spirits. If you pour straight into this. Yep. Right, so we're going to put some meths in there. Right, I've just lit that. That's now burning away nicely. Windshield on, and we'll start by cooking on it.
In the green bag. No, the other green bag. Open the lid up. The Sausages. Green. Uh, they are. In the corner. That's it. That pot's a bit too big for this really, but it's just what's left over in the uh, lump in the making warehouse that we're not using. Let's see how it gets on. Okay. Oh, the new pocket stove. It still goes. It's going for about five minutes now. Sausages are coming along nicely. It's going all right. And this one's going along well as well. Going alright as well. And here I've got the simmer plate on that one. So that one I can adjust using the simmer plate. This one I can't adjust. But it's um, burning beautifully. Right, been on for about 10 minutes. It's still burning away. Sausages are coming along nicely. And I think it's uh, still burning all right. Can't really see the flame, but it's definitely there. But it's still going. Sausages are coming along now. well. So, so far, that gets a thumbs up from me. Should be having lunch soon. Right, well they're done. I had to refill it, but it's done a good job. So, hot dogs are ready. We say the real test is in the eating, so perfect. Just thumbs up from me. Right, we've had our lunch. Time to start putting everything away. I let that burn itself out, so there's no no fuel in it. It's completely empty. So the pocket stove, I think we say is a success. Good bit of kit. And now it's uh, time to start clearing up the gear. LNT, leave no trace. I've allowed that one to burn itself out as well. Do I have to pack that one up? And uh, we'll start clearing down. And this little sheltered spot here is quite warm, which is quite nice. Right, so I'll just start clearing up and then we'll start filming once we start moving out. Here's the bottom of the two pans we used today. This one was used on the mountain warehouse stove. That one was used on the pocket stove. This one, pocket stove, hardly any soot at all. This one, like a marrow stove, caked in it. 
So, if I say that one works every time, that's quite good. Less soot. Shows us a, a burning quite efficient. Right, we'll get these cleaned up and carry on with clearing up. Okay, LNT, leave no trace, you never know we were here. Car park's just coming to sight. Still people heading up the top there. So we'll be getting back at the car in a matter of a couple of minutes. Thank you.